What's up, Faith Squad? Just got something that's on my mind and my heart that I want to talk about real quick. This is going on where I live at. And I just want to talk about it real quick with y'all. this morning. A call was received at our emergency communication section regarding shots being fired here at number 38 Fountain Square, the Fifth Third Center. Um, what we know is an individual entered the loading dock area of the building, began firing shots, uh, then proceeded to the lobby area of the building where he was engaged by several of our officers. Uh, there were gunshots exchanged. Uh, at this point, the shooter is deceased. We also have five victims, uh, additional victims that sustained injuries. Of those five, we have received word that three of those five are deceased as well. So a very horrific situation. Sad, y'all. Just sad. You hear me? Horrible. Heartbreaking, y'all. This is just sad. Uh, mm, mm, mm. About, um, what is it Lord have mercy touch us Lord wrap your arms around this world Jesus y'all this is so heartbreaking do y'all hear me yeah I got to talk about it. Uh, why I always do that yeah? why I always be like what's up Bina oh her man her fail yeah how y'all doing? Hope everybody's having a blessed day. Hope everybody thank the good Lord for another day. Let me turn this down a little bit, but we about to get into this. Hope y'all all having a blessed day and thank the Lord for another day, y'all, for real, because my intentions was to come on here and try to do a Bobby Brown review part two. But I'm going to be honest with y'all, I wasn't feeling it. I was more supporting last night on YouTube and about two, three different lives than even paying attention to it. But I did, once I got off the live, go back and, you know, glance through it a little bit or whatever. But I figured it out. Part two didn't draw my attention as part one. I don't know if it was just going too fast, too many of the was going fast. Because all I can tell y'all is I remember Bobby breaking down. <laughs> Four different times, y'all, within two hours, they stuffed everybody that passed, his mama, his daddy, Whitney, and Bobby Christina, may they all rest in peace. But it just went too fast, y'all. It was too fast. It was too sloppy. It was too messy. I was confused on the part about the last light, light skin girl that he was messing with. I remember in the beginning when they was younger, she was there. They was cool, friends, whatever. I was all over the place, y'all. So I don't know. I wasn't really feeling that. So that leads me to... That and everybody else that's going to review it, I'll just listen to what y'all felt about it. Meanwhile, back at the ranch, y'all, oh my God, so sad. I think I'm going to have the, in the beginning of this, in the beginning of my opening, because y'all see we don't have a, um, y'all know I'm by the window. Y'all see we don't have our intro, because I'm working on that. All the intros, uh, that you know, they just, they wasn't, I wasn't feeling them as much as I thought I was. Once you know you receive constructive criticism and then you peep stuff yourself better. So I'm trying to work. I'm working on a nice intro, y'all. So in the beginning of this video, y'all seen that I had it on the news. 19, Fox 19.com news. Yeah, that is right across the bridge from me, five minutes away. That's where I was born at, Cincinnati, Ohio. Yes, that's where I was born at. I'm now residing in Kentucky. Yes, right five minutes across the bridge from Cincinnati, Ohio. So I'm born and raised in Cincinnati, Ohio with a little bit of slash Kentucky. You know, I grew up in Kentucky. I, we moved here when I was 15. I'm 38 now. Long story longer, y'all. I was just up. You know, y'all know I be up. and I, I do. I watch the news. And mom used to always tell me, girl, you quit watching the news. You know, a lot of people, you, you, you really shouldn't. But I do. And, um... Yeah, it's so heartbreaking. I don't even know the full story of it yet. This news been I started watching it when this happened. It was about probably nine o'clock. This happened about nine fifteen, y'all. Downtown Cincinnati. That's our local, you know, every state got a downtown. That's our busy office building place, bus stop, all that. Fifth third bank. 
I'm assuming because they just had some lady come on here and talk to the camera, and I guess she was a doctor type, a psychologist or whatever. Basically, I'm assuming I'm going to put the story together for myself, and then I'll come back in another video and tell y'all when I really found out what's going on. But the chief of police is also talking in the beginning of the video, the black guy. I think he was from Chicago, too, before he came here. I'm sorry I'm talking fast, y'all, but I don't want this to be a long video, but... I'm assuming he got fired, y'all, came into work today, and just start blasting, just start shooting people, y'all. You got the people outside fixing the plants, you got the people going this way, get coffee, donuts, this way to go to work, this way to, I mean, y'all just busy, it's busy downtown. So they saying that he came through the landing dock of the Fifth Third Bank, and um, yeah, just basically start shooting, and, uh, and, and now in the middle of the story, I'm seeing that they're saying all together is five people. The shooter's dead, three of the other people are dead, and two people are in critical condition. Lord have mercy, Jesus, y'all. When I tell y'all the people that they interviewing that either worked in the building near the fifth third or whatever, y'all, y'all need to look it up and check it out. Y'all, it's deep, y'all, but it just can happen anywhere, and I'm just so heartbroken by it because my bad, because y'all, these people didn't wake up today going to work thinking they weren't going to be coming home. I swear, I try to stress so bad, y'all, and I know we all not perfect. I'm not perfect, but y'all, we are human. We are all God's children, y'all. Y'all, we got to reach out and love each other and, 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 and talk to each other and speak to people and be at the bus stop and conversate with a person or something like that. They might be having a bad day. This man probably, whatever, I don't know the history of it. I don't know if he worked there. I don't even know. I'm just knowing, telling you out of pieces what they're telling me. But this man probably was sitting at work next to somebody every day and had stuff on his mind. And these two people, co-workers, probably didn't even speak. Or I don't know, y'all. I just, you get, it's too much going on in this world for this type of stuff to be going on if it could be prevented. You know, if it could be prevented, rather he had something going on. I don't know what he had going on, but whatever it is, I'm sure if he had somebody genuinely, genuine, I don't know. I'm not saying it like, because I don't know the past, so I don't want to say it like that. But I'm sure it could have been a way for him not to feel this way where his mind and mental had to be this way. He ain't the only one that's been going on around this world forever, y'all. But what is the reason for the people to be like this? Like, I know stuff happens as you grow up and stuff. We all done been through stuff, but y'all... We got to love more. I'm just saying. We got to love more. We got to talk to each other more. We got to speak more. You know, you ain't got to be out extra with it. If you, I understand some people ain't that type of people. Some people ain't going to talk to people. Don't want to do all that. But sometimes you got to make them, y'all. You know, you got to make them. And when I say make them, like even if you got to kill them with kindness, like say you walking and you speak to somebody and they, you know, or they don't, and I'll be like, well, all right, you have a good day. You know, I hope everything get better for you or something. And I know some people mind thinking like, Girl, you don't know if they're going to run up on you behind you after you say that to them. Like, who you talking to? You know, you just never know. But I don't know, y'all. Just, I'm just sitting here thinking, like, and I'm just really tripped out about this. Not tripped out, I guess, because it's really close to home. And I don't I don't remember too many stories like this happening as I done grew up close to where I live at. And it's just heartbreaking, y'all, because it happens everywhere, y'all. So I'm just saying, yeah, we got to love more. We have to. We got to love more. We got to be people people more you know you got to check on people you got to care for people more than be all this negative stuff and all this hate and all this drama and all that stuff i guess as you get older you you get over it you know and i guess that's what's going on with me because you know like i said i ain't perfect and all that and i ain't trying to make it like i'm perfect but i just know in life i ain't trying to be angry and mean and negative all the time i'm not if i have my days or something just let me you, when you have your day, you feel like that's how you're going to be after you pray about it or whatever. You know what I mean? Just just don't don't take it out on other folks. You know what I mean? Shake it off the best way you can and keep it pushing. Life's too short, y'all. And I love y'all. And this was just a quick little something I wanted to come on here and talk to y'all about that was on my mind and my heart. And, you know, y'all my people, so I feel like I could talk to y'all. Some of y'all feel me, some of y'all don't, but I still love you. But anyway, so y'all make sure y'all have a blessed Thursday. Tomorrow's Friday. Everybody get to chill on the weekend. If y'all do got to work on the weekend, just think at it like you're chasing that bag. You're getting that money. You feel me? I love y'all so much. Being a Bina in the background is just me and Bina. Ooh, baby. But 
But y'all, yeah, I was feeling the Bobby part two. Maybe I need to watch it again, or maybe I'm going to come and listen to some of y'all reviews. But peace, love, and blessings to you all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, y'all. Make sure y'all share our videos on y'all social media, please. Please do that for me, y'all. If I knew how to do all this stuff and stuff, I'd be doing it. But I, I would go on another social media site, my Instagram or whatever, tag y'all picture, y'all name, anything. I don't really do Twitter like that because I don't know how. But I'll put y'all on my Snapchat. I'll do all that stuff to show some love for the people. You feel me? I'm being silly, y'all. But y'all have a good day. I'm having one so far so good besides this heartbreaking news. Y'all comment. Let me know about it. If y'all got any questions about it, y'all want to talk about it, discuss it, anything, let me know. Hit your girl up. Love y'all. Peace, love, and blessings. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Because who we riding with? We riding with the angels in my ratchet voice. Love y'all.